Uh, well, I'm Chris. I'm the general manager of Donnybrook Packing Company, which is part of the Delroy business. The pack shed, uh, we predominantly pack avocados. We do pack um, other fruit, some kiwis, some plums, some apples. Uh, right now, we're packing some apples. We employ, in the heart of the season, maybe 100, 120 people. We've got 18 full-time staff here from all over the world. So Japan, Taiwan, the Philippines, a few of these kicking around. So the journey for Safeag for Donnybrook Packing, it was already in place in the orchard, sort of embryonically when I started. Um, and we've taken it as a business from there and really taken it on and tested how far we can take Safeag from a safety perspective with what we do. We use a lot of the task management, we use the checklists, we use Ag Auditor as the new thing we're getting, <laughs> we're getting involved in and really enjoying learning how that can benefit the, benefit the business. We've got a lot of people, as I said before, who don't have English as their first language. So being able to provide them with a simple, generic process that they can follow, um, the imagery that you can add in to whether it's a procedure or a, or a checklist part, that's been fantastic for us. Meaning that you get a lot of buy-in from your people that you employ to actually complete the tasks. It's not too difficult for them to understand. We needed to update what we did at the shed with our safety systems and SafeAg was a, has been a really good fit for us. We were very document heavy and this has enabled us to put all our documents together. It's also helped with the version control and the review dating that SafeAg offers us that the amount of administration we have to have as a larger system can be a lot smaller and more manageable. I like the functionality of it, especially with the upgrade. It's really good, the fact that you can use the system on your phone, you can use it on a tablet, and then that all feeds through into a dashboard, which is very user-friendly. So me as the general manager of the shed, I can look and pull apart what's being, what's being done and what's being looked at. And then if I've got my operators or my supervisors on the floor conducting the tasks, that's a very user-friendly method for them to put it in. Um, what we've really enjoyed is the fact that in each one of our checklists we can link that to a task and then that task links back to the maintenance team. So it promotes a good culture within the business. So when you see a problem, you don't walk past that problem. You highlight that to the right people involved. And then th there's that accountability through the shed and the staff to make sure that those jobs are completed. 